Hey, this is Eric with Program at Eric.com, and today we're going to look at Herelia, and we're going to look at plugins for Herelia. So there are ways you can share custom configurations that interact with Herelia's internals. That's They have a whole plugin structure that Herelia has that you can use, that third-party and then internal plugins. To get an idea of where you can find the plugins, there's actually a GitHub, I'll include this in the show notes, called Herelia Registry. And inside there, you can find the core plugins, and then you can also look, uh, find the plugin registry for third-party plugins. And so there's all sorts of things in here. Uh, for example, there's Firebase. Someone already created a Firebase one. There's Fetch. And today, we're going to just do a quick one on Aurelia Notify. So this is a nice little plugin that creates a Notify box for you once you install it, and it works with uh, Aurelia. So if you remember, we're still in our same basic sample app here with our three routes. Our, we load it here. See, it's still all working as we expect. And we have our few different routes here and our different view view models. So if you bring up the code here. Now last time we went ahead and went into the, to the source folder. And we went into and we created a main a main JS file, and inside this main JS file, we created this logger, and we also did some configuration of the application. This is a completely, this is a a file that's optional, but this is also where we add plugins. So let's go ahead and add a plugin. But before we do that, let's just install it. So we do jspn install Aurelia notify. And great, now it's installed. So now we're going to go into our source, our main JS file, and we're going to add this plugin. So we'll just do plugin, and you can have as many as you want here. You just add another line that says plugin. So really a notify. And now we can start using it. So let's add it to our welcome JS file. And first we'll import, uh, we're going to use something called in, the injection. It's an injection decorator. And this is how, this is one way we can inject different things into our application. So we're going to notification service. And that's going to be from Aurelia Notify. And to get this working, we're going to have to inject it. So now we have our notification service. Now, we have this welcome here, and we want to use this notification service. So the easiest, way, easiest thing we can do is we'll create a uh, constructor. And this is a part of the, the component lifecycle which you can find in the official documentation. There's a few built-in methods that you can use. This constructor gets initiated as soon as this view model is created. So now we have this notification service. So instead of doing this alert here, we can do something like this, this dot notification service, and we have a, quite a few options. If we look at the documentation for here, we look at the getting started, explains kind of the same things we were just doing, but there's info, there's warning, info, success, warning, and danger. So let's put danger. Let's try danger. So let's go back to the app here. We'll go danger. And we'll just copy this. We'll insert it in. Okay, let's see if that works. And we'll load our HTTP server, and we'll refresh.
Oops, let me check here one second. Oops. Okay, I think I know what the problem is. So we'll stop this, and we'll look at the source. Welcome to welcome.js file. And we did everything correctly here, but you can see here, we have this dot notification service equals notificat service. So this is supposed to be notification service. So let's try that again. Okay, great. And let's hit the submit button. And you can see there it is. Welcome John Doe in a big red line here letting us know that there's something wrong. And there's actually probably an error behind here too. But you can just see it's working. Great. So that's it. So that's how you use plugins. And like I said, Check out this registry, uh, GitHub. You can see all the different third-party plugins people have created that you can use in your early app. It can save you a lot of time, and people are creating stuff all the time, so check it out. And if you have any questions, leave it in the comments below. And please check out my mailing list. I give away a free Aurelia cheat sheet if you sign up, and the link's in the description below. Thanks.